After a dilation centered at the origin, the image of, C, of segment CD is C prime D prime. If the coordinates of the endpoints of these segments are, and they list out the coordinates here, the scale factor of the dilation is. So what this question is really asking for is whether or not you remember how to, uh, to dilate something on a coordinate grid. And the way in which we dilate something uh, by a factor of, let's say, k, with respect to the origin, is we take this scale factor and we multiply by the coordinates, respectively. So if the original, if the original coordinate was a comma b, and you want to dilate by a factor of k um, over the origin, then the coordinates, the new coordinates, will become k times a comma k times b. So all we got to do is we got to take c prime and c and see what the um, what the factor is. So if we're going from let's say c, which is six comma negative four, and then we're going to c prime, which is nine comma negative six, what are we doing here? So we're actually multiplying six by what to get to nine? We're actually multiplying by three halves, right? How did I get that? I took nine divided by six. And we're going to take negative 6 over negative 4. And what is that? That, too, is also 3 halves. So one more time, to figure out why, why k is equal to 3 halves, you just take the, 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 um, the new x-coordinate divided by the old x-coordinate. This should all be the same between the new y-coordinate and the old y-coordinate. And this is going to hold true for every for all the coordinates, um, not just C, but for D as well, if the scale factor was applied uniformly. So if I take D, which is 2 comma negative 8, so I take 2 comma negative 8, and I multiply this by 3 halves, you should end up with 3 comma negative 12. And is that really the case? That is indeed the case. So the scale factor here is 3 halves.